I'm Barry Schilling with U.S. Waterproofing. Have you ever given any thought to how much water comes off your roof when it rains? Here we have a simple drawing of a roof line and we're going to work with half of the roof here. There's two dimensions that are important. The width, which is A, and the length, B. For example, let's say A equals 20 feet. Let's say dimension B, the length, equals 50 foot. 20 foot times 50 foot equals 1,000 square feet. Talk about rain. If you were to get just a small one inch rain on this section of roof, we have one inch of rain, 1,000 square foot of roof, equals 600 gallons of water. That's right, 600 gallons of water is going to come off of this small section of roof with only a one inch rain. Now let's look at the guttering system. We have a gutter with two downspouts. Take that 600 gallons, divide by two downspouts, that's 300 gallons of water at each downspout when it rains. But why is this water important to you? This is the water that leaks into your basement. It's the water that makes your sump pump run more frequently. And if you leave this water next to your house for a long period of time, it can cause the foundation to have structural issues. 